Hi, good evening. It's just a weekend update. Uh, it's an update from me. Uh, it's Friday. Hope you're all having a good uh, May, May, May this year so far. It's getting a bit warmer. Um, I'm do admit now that I don't know why you put this loungewear on today. These ladies' bottom <laughs> bottoms in this top. Uh, too hot too hot but most of my lounge wearing that I bought and ladies clothes is more winter stuff but yeah um, I'm just trying to make do with what I've got and I would like to buy some more clothing as I say uh, but I can't really buy anything else yet until my mum's helped me sort my clothes and that out that I need but touch wood touch wood it won't be that long my dad's recovering from his urine infection and my nana's getting better so so yeah, um, I've been in all day today, apart from going out for about 10-15 minutes when I went to Asda for a bottle of beer and that, because I fancied one. Uh, but yeah, um, I've been waiting in all day for the cleaners to come. They haven't turned up. Or one, they haven't turned up. So, been in touch with the manager. She can't, she doesn't know why they've not turned up, but they're going to try to reschedule it for Monday. So, so yeah. So, yeah, hopefully I can get things back on track there. Uh, but, yeah, um, I had some issues with Amazon uh, the other day. Uh, and I wasn't expecting to make a profit off it. But I made about £23.55. Uh, but, yeah, um, I'm a little bit annoyed, annoyed with certain things with Amazon. But, yeah, it's like I've had to, order, I've had to send a couple of items back to to um get replacement ones uh to try and get replacement ones for the correct value uh for the fact that for so i can get free delivery uh, i damaged my radio the other day i'm not sure if it was water damage or not but i've got a portable dab radio and that stopped working the other day i don't know if it was water damage or what but that stopped working the other day and i got a refund on that and i wanted to to um i wanted to send off another adapter that i've got faulty one of the my aux adapter i've got an aux adapter for the iphone as well where you can connect headphones through the lightning port uh but the issue was with amazon they like ask for your order number they asked you for the order number and they refunded me on the order but i'm like i had to sort it out last night and tonight because they'd refunded and gave me the wrong return label for the wrong item so they refunded me on a cable that wasn't the correct cable so I went through the through with them and said uh, you've got this yeah it's not this cable it's not this cable so they put me through it with someone else they said they'd refunded me on it as on it as well so so then it was not the correct not the correct cable in that that they'd refunded me for I found out today that the, when they try to resolve it they still issued the wrong refund so. They gave me a refund today on the item that I was supposed to get a refund on and they just told me to keep the refund off the off the other item as a gesture of goodwill so I wasn't expecting two refunds there but I wouldn't have minded I wouldn't have minded honestly and personally them giving me a return label a printable return label for the item that I wanted to send back for them to refund me on the item on the item uh for them to refund me on the item that i wanted to send back and to cancel the refund on the item that they gave me the wrong refund for so so yeah um there's all that sorted there's no formula one this week so i had to have a bit of a tidy up this afternoon tonight i don't normally clean the bathroom and that on on the day that the cleaners come I normally just, when I get washed in that in the morning, normally get washed, get showered, and then just leave it for the cleaners to do. Want, well, I only leave it for the cleaners. I only leave it for the cleaners the day that they come in 
every time every time I get a shower I rinse the shower out I rinse the shower out I hoover the bathroom floor and I put the bath mats back down and put the shower seat back into the shower and then I rinse it out again I do get the cleaners in to help me do the bits that I can't do but it's it's that it's I don't see the point of cleaning the bathroom after I've had a shower if the cleaner's gonna do it properly anyway. So yeah, um once yeah, so this afternoon I'd had a bit of a tidy up. Uh I'd had a bit of a tidy up just to get things a little bit more cleaner for the weekend. It so yeah, it looks a bit weird the bathroom still but they're hopefully going to try to fit me in again on Monday, but but yeah, it's like I have plans. I've been in touch with my mind, and I've seen uh, opportunity for media volunteers, and that's the one people who have mental health issues and that kind of thing to work within the media industry on a voluntary role, uh, whether it's with the media industry for TV articles or whether it's in in the form of newspaper articles and that I have it is what I want to get into and and that's what my YouTube channel is about making awareness about being me and about mental health about cross dressers transgender rights and that so I am looking at doing this doing that uh, so I am, as I say, I am looking at doing this, doing that. But the issue was, I've had to email more than one email address for mind, because, uh, because uh, I got a failure, failure to send one. But if I do get the opportunity, I'll do get the option for that voluntary opportunity. That uh, that would be perfect for me because that's what I'm trying to develop the YouTube channel into. So. So yeah, I've got a passion for it and it's what I want to go down for the media industry and that as well. Um, I have on another note emailed the job centre back, uh, senior management and at this time CEOs and that of different departments and that to try to see if they can get me an appointment and uh, just to try to see if they, they can get me an appointment and that kind of thing just, just so that I can get some structure and routine to my day and as I say I can't really go down the correct avenues and that for voluntary work or training at the moment because I need extra support whilst I'm in employment so it's just a bit of a catch-22 also I had been getting passed on between social services and that still in the doctors and mental health support but yeah I'm just trying to keep my chin up try to work on ideas bring people in that know me the best uh, these ladies these ladies bottoms and loungewear bottoms are really comfortable but they're a little bit hot at this time warm at this time of year but but yeah um I do want to date and that as well and I wouldn't mind meeting anyone that wants to meet for a coffee who is open about the cross dresser and the transgender issues, the uh, autism, and that's someone that I can maybe dress with, and someone that I can maybe dress with, someone that I could uh, dress with, and someone that I could be true to myself with, and that kind of thing. And as I say, I hold my hands up, I'm not perfect, I've never dated, I'm still a virgin. I do. Uh, want to date and that kind of thing but but yeah I'm just, just starting to enjoy being me and I'm really in I know that I'm having ups and downs and that at the moment but since I have started the cross dressing and that properly and starting to get things into motion that again I'm really enjoying the journey that I'm on e even with the ups and downs so yeah um, I am just trying to keep my head head up and my chin up really for the weekend as the flat's going to be a little bit more messy than what I would have liked but I have had a bit of a tidy up today taken the cushions off the couch and hoovered 
under the cushions and everything. I normally do that once or twice a week anyway. It's just that I, I eat on the couch and that uh, because I have an apartment. So yeah, um, I'm just trying to keep the flat as best as I can and try to work try to work on new ideas and that kind of thing. But yeah, if you want to know anything else or if you do want to meet up, start having professional conversations and that and I would like to uh, as I would like to uh, meet new people and that kind of thing uh, just a uh, disclosure out there um, um, if you leave nasty comments or offending comments on the YouTube channel, you will be blocked and reported. Uh, um, I made a video. Uh, I made a video the other day, which would have been. I am just checking. So I made a video the other day, which would have been. Uh, about four, about four or five videos ago, uh, about people leaving negative comments. I got commented on that video about four or five videos ago. Uh, by I got a comment by someone advising me to watch Spacca say no. Uh, to say that it would help me understand and that things a lot better. Uh, Behaviour like that will not be tolerated on this channel and you will be removed from the channel and your comment blocked. I have reported the individual. I have reported the individual as this channel is for people that want to be true to themselves and not feel ashamed of who they are and not feel ashamed of being true to themselves without without the fear of being criticised in that. Uh, just a, a word of warning that any comments and like that to me or to other people's comments or to other people that follow this channel will be reported and, and removed from the channel. So I am just putting it out there, but yeah, um, but yeah. Other than other than that, I'm feeling a lot better, and I do want to get get uh, moving on with the channel and channel developments and that as well. Uh, but yeah, um, thank you. Bye.